Pizza Tips Pro. This is Shreeja here, and in today's video, we are gonna see how to add a parallax scrolling effect in WordPress. So, before getting into the video, if you guys haven't yet subscribed to the Pizza Tips Pro, please do subscribe. And now, let's get into the video. So, you can add scrolling effects to your product images and text and the background of your site with this parallax scrolling effect. So, this will help you get a lot of potential from your visitors and it will encourage them to check out your content so it it makes it it makes your website more attractive to the visitors so uh, let's add scrolling effect to our website so in order to add this parallax scrolling effect we're going to do three steps so our first step is to get elementor pro plugin so you can get this elementor pro plugin i have shown in the previous videos also and in this video i'll just show you that you just need to uh, you can just go to the, any search engine and you can go for elementor pro plugin buying options and you can find these are the uh, plans that are available so we can just go with this essential uh, one that is for one pro website so we have i'm just currently assuming that you have one website and we just need it for one website so we can choose this plan which says it's 49 us dollars per year so you can just click on buy now so you can see its features also like drag and drop and responsive design and some widgets and we have templates theme builders premium support so then so next uh, we just need to create an account for your for our Elementor Pro. So make sure you use the email address that you used for your uh, WordPress website. So after you select this plan, you go to this buy now and then you click on create account and here you fill the details and then you just need to enter the email account uh, email that you use for your WordPress and then click on check out just pay and give some payment details like which are essential and then uh, you can just click on this download elementor pro so then uh, we just go back to our wordpress dashboard so this will be our wordpress dashboard and here you can find a plugin section over here so then uh, this will be our step number two that is installing our elementor pro plugin so you just go up to the plugins and just click on um, install plugin and new plugin so after you click on add new plugin uh, you just need to click on upload plugin and then after clicking, clicking on the upload plugin you can just uh, take the zip file that you have just downloaded that is the elementor pro uh, plugin so you just need to drag and drop it here in this choose file so after you do this click on install and then click on activate plugin and then uh, you just need to click on connect and activate in order to activate our plugin so click on activate again and then here you can see your status is active now so then you can see that your status is active now and now we can start using our plugin so now we'll go we are moving to the step number three that is adding our scrolling effect to our site so then uh, we'll go to the visit site and here you can find this is our site how it's looking like and now uh, we just need to click on edit with the elementor and then you will be landing onto this kind of page so here so this will be the elementor editing page so here you just need to click on the image if i just click on this image and then once you click on it go to the advanced settings and here you can find in the advanced settings you can find motion effects so in this motion effects click on scrolling effects so here you can see this is the scrolling effects which is in off like you can make it on in order to uh, enable the scrolling effects and then here you can find this vertical scroll so you have different kinds of scrolling effects also so for this i want to choose this vertical uh, scrolling effect and then you can even adjust the speed like how faster it should move so then you can see uh, uh, i just chosen my direction to down and my speed to five and then you see uh, we even 
uh, we can even uh, change this viewpoint like you can adjust it according to your preview like you just need you can just make a preview of how it's looking after you make some changes and you can adjust the viewpoint accordingly so don't be afraid to explore all other uh, all other settings of this elementor pro plugin so then once you are done with this and now uh, we'll be seeing our scrolling effect to the text so in order to add the scrolling effect to the text uh, let's say here we uh, here we can see save your creativity so this text i want to add my scrolling effect so in order to do this just click on this text and once you click on the text and again go to the advanced settings and here in the advanced settings you can find this motion effects click on the motion effects and uh, turn on the scrolling effects and here i want to choose this horizontal scroll and then we can just click on this horizontal scroll and you can uh, select the direction like it's to the left i have chosen and the speed is to be 5 and you can um, adjust this viewpoint also and then you can make it uh, you can make this adjust this viewpoint and also you can add this fade in effect like you can add uh, it, it should be faded and once it comes to the center of your screen it should be visible completely so you can even add this fade in effect by using this transparency setting in the motion settings you can just go to the transparency and you can give the direction or like it is it to be fade in or fade out and then you can give uh, your level and your viewpoint settings so in the same way you can add scrolling effects to all the text like you, you just need to go to the motion effect scrolling effect and just you need to uh, go to this horizontal uh, scrolling effect and and anything like it's all up to you like you can choose anything according to your create a uh, creativity or which you find like it looks more attractive on your website you can just do it like that uh, you can try many many uh, kinds of settings in this elementor pro plugin so you can explore them you can sit explore them at at a time so that you can find like what are the amazing results of these settings and then uh, you can even add this animation to all our other text also like all the other text and then uh, well if we want to add this same uh, animation to this all text you just click on this go to the motion effects and give your scrolling effects and then you give your horizontal scroll and also your transparency so in order to add this animation to this text also and then you can even add your uh, mouse track like when you hover onto a image it moves so in order to do this you just need to select an image and then you go back to the advanced settings and in the motion settings you can see this mouse track so click on this option and then so that when you hover onto your image it moves and then uh, we can even add the speed like at what rate it should move like this it moves like you can see in this it looks like this and it would move like this and then you can even add your 3d 3d effects to your image like you can just click on this 3d tilt and you can add this kind of uh, animation to your image so then now we will see how can we do this to our how can we add this effect to our background so um, when you see this this is our background and i want to fix this background and this text is moving so in order to firstly fix this background uh, so go to the section where you want to add this background effect and once you click on it so here you need you need to click and once you click on it you can find uh, this three layout style and advanced go to the style section and here you can find this attachment and select the attachment to be fixed so you can just select this fixed here and then uh, you just need to uh, add this scaling effect and you just need to add your speed and your viewport you just need to adjust it accordingly and after that your image looks fixed now and then uh, same way you can uh, same way you can add this uh, scrolling effects to other sections also in this way so after doing all the changes don't forget to click on this update button so that your changes are saved so in this way you can add your parallax scrolling effects to your website 
So I hope you found this video useful to you guys. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like, share and subscribe to PC Tips Pro.